everyone and welcome to Red United TV. It's your boy Ivorian Spice back at it again with another match reaction. And remember guys, if you're new to this channel, remember to subscribe, smash that like button, remember to share because sharing Ivorian Spice is caring. Boom! And guys, happy Mother's Day to all you mums around the world. Yes, you mothers have done everything for us. We'd like to thank you here at Red United TV. God bless you. We love you all. And yet again, happy Mother's Day to all of you mothers out there. You are the one. And today, guys, it's Manchester United 1, West Ham United 0. Manchester United collecting three points. Boring game as always today. Yet another boring game in the Premier League. Oh, oh, shit. Oh. Yes, at times you could have fell asleep. It was a dead game. Dead, dead game. Nothing to offer for us today. But yet, we win with an own goal from West Ham. <laughs> Man like Craig Dawson, bro. You must be feeling like shit. But yes, again, today it proved that. Yet again, today it proved that we are shit at opening teams with the ball. Awful, dreadful at times, guys. And yeah, concerning. It's concerning as always. But then again, what can you say? Some of you are happy. You're happy with this performance. You're like, yep, we've got the three points. I'm pleased too that we've got the three points. Overall, I'm happy about that. But the performance-wise, we were shit again, yet again. Guys, <sighs> this is what we, we're going to get used to. We've got to get used to this, you know. This is our cup of tea, our appetite. Well, this is tea without no sugar, you know. And some of you guys can drink tea without no sugar. That's why you've got them people there that support it is. But I'm used to having tea with some sugar in it, man. My coffee with some sugar. Some honey, because I'm exquisite out here, you know. I'm luxurious, so I prefer some honey in it, you know. And because I support my tonight, we're supposed to be getting some honey in our tea and our coffee. But yet again, ugh, we get no tea, no sugar, no nothing. Just, ugh. Blank taste of the, what coffee really tastes like and tea tastes like. It's what it's like. We're getting a real taste of what Manchester sport of what supporting Manchester United feels like. And it's not nice right now. The football is dreadful. It's tasteless. It is. Ugh. And let's go straight into that game, guys, because that first 30 minutes was absolutely pants, bro. Nothing to really tell to say in that game. Apart from the fact that Marcus Rashford, oh my god, man. Rashford, man, where is your brain at time? And you know exactly, guys, what I'm talking about. Those two headers, especially when he goes for the headers. I know again, yet again, CPU crashes down when he goes for it. Doom. Oh, Marcus Rashford, 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 Crashford. Ugh, what is going on, man? Two good opportunities to score, you know. But yeah, again, it's not his fault. Rashford is not known to score in headers at the end of the day. He does close his eyes at times. Yeah, big man, you're a big man in the game. You cannot be closing your eyes when he goes for a head off. You have to head the ball. And Mason Greenwood as well, having a good opportunity to score, a good chance, a good shot with Lucas Fabiassi saving that shot. Yet again, nil-nil half time. Oh boring as of course. Going into that second half, you're thinking, ah, oh, not another game where you just start drowsing and falling asleep. And yet, no, not another game where it's been, you know, shit. I, yeah, I, I keep saying the word shit so many times. You know, I can even smell the shit, bruv, because that's how shit we are. You know, I keep repeating it. And I do apologise, guys, that why I keep repeating it, because it is what we, we are in terms of the way we play our football. Second half, guys, going into it. Mason Greenwood again hits the post for the second time. I'm there thinking, what's going on? Especially on the break as well. Second half starts, guys. Yes, we get the goal. Finally, with an own goal, unfortunately. Craig Dawson scoring an own goal from the set piece by Bruno Fernandes. We might as well just call it a Bruno Fernandes assist because, yeah, again... It's because of him we get that own goal. Well, McTominay did fairly try to attack the ball. But yeah, again, it did come off of Dawson. Mason Greenwood, unfortunately, again, hitting the post for the second time, guys. Mason Greenwood on a break. Again, what is going on with Mason Greenwood? It's just not happening for Mason Greenwood these days, guys. Manchester United, man. Greenwood is not having his best season. Four goals so far for Mason Greenwood. 
I'm hoping that he can turn up soon. But for him right now, his season has been poor. And guys, I am so annoyed with Ole Gunnar Solskjaer not making a substitution at all in that whole game. I find it disgraceful that he cannot make a substitution. Bring, put on Diallo, put someone on, you know. Trust in your players. Do you not trust your players that much? It's just damn right disgusting. It's disgusting. He should be making his subs. But who am I to tell him that he shouldn't make his subs? He thought he didn't need to, but I thought he did. With the match finishing 1-0, Man United doing nothing towards West Ham's goal. In fact, we didn't score a goal. We didn't score at all. We, we done nothing. We done nothing throughout the whole 90 minutes apart from the own goal. So we never did anything overall, guys. Football-wise, poor slacking. But yeah, we get the three points and then we move on because we reclaim second place. So overall, guys, I'm happy. I am happy so far with the result. But the performance, again, shite. Man of the match today, guys, got to go to Luke Skywalker. Luke Shaw. Ah, oh, this guy. Everything went through Luke Shaw. Everything good, everything positive went through Luke Shaw, guys. And again, he's just giving a strong performance after another, after another. He's improving. Tell us, thank you for coming because you have transformed Luke Shaw's performance here. Right now, he's like, oh, shit, I really got to work these days because this tennis guy is good. But now he's doing his thing, Luke Shaw, and he's just forever skywalking, you know. The force is with this guy, my brother. Imagine how, Alex, it's been a... Up and down week for us. We drew against AC Milan, winning against um, West Ham without playing the best football. All I've got to say, guys, is that get used to it again. There's been, there's been potential news that Oli might get a new contract. You know, it's in line. I don't know how you guys feel about that. You let me know how you, if you got. You let me know how you guys feel about that. And guys, this has been your match reaction by Ivory and Spice. Do let me know who your man in the match was. And of course, let me know who your donkey of the match was. Because I didn't have one today. And also let me know what you thought about today's game as well. And let me know what you think about Ali getting in a new contract. Guys, as always, remember to follow the official Instagram account of Red United TV. Which is Red United TV 1, baby. And the official TikTok account of Red United TV, which is Red United TV. And remember to follow my personal Instagram account, which is Ivorian underscore Spice. Same goes for that Twitter. Same goes for that Snapchat. And remember, guys, remember to look in the link description. Forget these shades. You get me elite eyewear as well. Got the fresh garments down there as well, as always. And also, if you're looking for catering, it's down there as well. Just look down to the link descriptions and everything. Thing. You get me guys and as always remember to subscribe smash that like button remember to share because sharing i have wearing spice is caring and as always guys remember to keep it united and of course non-united top today for i just switch it up next time in the united top will come on because right now i'm just feeling a bit good right now it's my day and as always remember to keep your soul united because we've just we've just given that bullshit and joined against milan and it's going to be a tough week coming and as always, remember to keep it ready now because I'm out. Peace out.